Welcome back to Love Method Classic and something a little different today. I had a um, subscriber who reached out to me a while ago and wants some help probably a year and a half ago about buying a car and we talked back and forth and he bought a lovely car. He brought it over today. He lives in Denmark. That's not that far away from here. So he came today to, um, to visit and brought his car along and I thought we'd have a look at the car and talk a little bit with him. So um, here we have Casper. Hello everyone, my name is Casper. I've had the pleasure of meeting Adam today and uh, showing him my XGS from 1989. So uh, until now, we're having a great time here in, in Sweden. Yeah. Let's go and have a look around the car and then we'll go for a little bit of a short drive as well. And here we have it. He bought it in January and it's really low mileage. It's uh, 40,000 kilometers and it's absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. And it's 1989, perfect color combination, gray on the outside and red on the inside. Really nice. So we've had a look around it. Engine is looks excellent. It sounds really good. He's uh, done some um, maintenance to it after watching some videos. And he's, uh, yeah, just tune ups and everything. But so it's very, very nice. So we're going to have a look through some of the things and some of the papers here and then go for a little bit of a spin. We just had a look here. How many of these still have their service booklet? Not many of them. And this one's not even filled out all the way. It's just had a service here, see two, 2022 at 38,000 kilometer service. So that is, um, it's an amazing, amazing, really well-preserved uh, car. You can have a brief look around the car before we go for a little drive. Beautiful, beautiful, the dark red interior. It has a factory fitted sunroof. It's, it's in the owner ma owner's manual and everything, so it's very, very cool. And nice headliner and everything. And we can just have a look at the business end, the V12. Looking very, very good. It's been, like you said, with that kind of mileage, it's been, let me get this over, very well taken care of. So looking really good. We can't find any leaks or anything doesn't smell of oil or anything and he says it runs perfectly so we're gonna go for a little bit of a test drive and then on the way when we get back I'm gonna talk a little bit more to Casper before he has to go back to Denmark so Casper how come you bought an XJS so I think the real story is that back when I was very very young six eight years old six years old maybe we were, when we were playing cars, the XJS was, was a toy car and this was always the first one that was taken, you know, ah. when we selected cars and, and I really loved the shape and we also played, you know, car carts yeah. and that was also a part of it. So, so I always loved the model, always had it in my, my head. I love cars. Since I was five years old, I've, I've known all models, you know, car models, but this one just stands out or did stand out already back then. And and, uh, and then I have been looking on and off for them. Uh, have been trying a lot of them, but they were poor state. The ones I've tried in Denmark. And then suddenly this one came up, and this was not really on sale on, on the on the internet. It was via someone else. I asked for another car, and he said, "Call this guy. He helped me with this car to fix it." And I called the seller. He said, well, I also have this one. And this one was this one. And he said, I have an XJS with 40,000 kilometers. Come, and, Don't you want to come and have a look? And I thought, maybe I should do that because it's not often you find a car with, with that mileage. No. So after having tried several of them and compared with this one, I, I bought it when I was up there. I drove it home in January you're not supposed to but the weather was okay yeah and uh, it was a 300 kilometer drive home no problems and uh, yeah so that's that's the, the short the short version the short version of it yeah that's absolutely beautiful we just went for a little drive i drove the first bit he drove the second bit and it feels really 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 solid that's the thing about next js it can be the best car ever or it can be an other disaster and uh, this one is very, very good. We're 
back from our little drive and it drives very very well this car and i'm really happy that you came to visit we've talked about this for a while but yeah things have happened with uh, time and and everything but it's been very fun and um, i've talked about i want to do a um, sort of living with a classic meet for people around here so you should definitely come back for that i will come next summer latest when you have your xgs back from yeah you have uh, to come come and try it yeah yeah and uh, maybe you'll come back for some small work yes, on the I car we'll we do, do that um, also some fuel hoses yeah. and things yeah but uh, really nice to see and I love that you said that you've watched the videos and used them as a bit of a guide when buying the car. So I that's... did. When I bought it, uh, I had never had a car like this before, but I've had classic cars since 2011. So I know a little bit what to look for, but of course for specific models, you have to, to know something in detail. And then I looked your videos and I did the simple tests as you did and I thought this one passed yeah this one <laughs> definitely passed very very nice so a little quick different video today have a subscriber come and have a look with their beautiful xgs anyways if you like this video please give a thumbs up share it with your friends if you're not already subscribed to the channel please do subscribe to the channel it really does help out a lot until next time i'm adam and this was casper this was a little bit of a classic i'll see you soon